Welcome back to part two. We are out here at beautiful Madeira's Golf Club. This is hole number 10. It is a 340 yard dog leg right up the hill and a lot of bunkers guarding the hole. Good ball. It's actually fine. Coach from one tiny has got a 54 in hand. Kind of chunked that one out. Flail onto the right, but uh, catch a piece of the green. Eastkey from 104. Traveling just right of the pin. Ooh! A little too much spin on it, but he's in tighter than Coach. Coach for par to stay three up. Mm. All right, hole 11 straight away par four, 360, downhill a little bit and a little face wind. B just pulled a little bit left of the pin. Ooh. Good distance control right there, just on the fringe. Very chip inable. Coach's second shot from 79. A little trap draw wedge in there. He's gonna play the little swooper, hope it spins left. And it did. Oh my goodness. All right, Coach here from two feet. He's just gonna tap it in. Beautiful putt. And now we got Bisky with an opportunity to have the hole. Coach is up two after a couple of bad three putts, but. He will go back to three up. All right, hole 12, par four, 445 yards straight away. Coach with the low punchy drive. Beautiful, it's gonna run down there. Beesky with the big high bomb cut. Beautiful. Coach here from 128, he's got a pitching wedge in hand. Play on the swooper, as per usual. Hoping to catch that slope there. Spin left, spin left. There we go. Really good yep, shot. still working. 20 feet. Beesky, 100 yards, will knock down 56. Oh my God. Oops, he meant chunked 56. Oops. Okay. All right, Bisky's got a tough little 25 yard chip. He's got to land it about halfway to the hole. A little thin to win energy. That's gonna be good. Beautiful. Yeah, well done. Nice little four footer. Okay. Good job. Beautiful yeah. save. Still three up on the match and uh, gonna put the pressure on beginning the last few holes. Boys have 450 on this par four here. It's up over the hill, a little bit blind tee shot, but straight away. <laughs> Coach has 186 uh, under these trees in the wind, so he's gonna do the driver off the deck, the sweeper. Beautiful, wow, what a shot. Keep on running. Bisky has 125 yards in. He's taking a pee wedge into the wind a bit, so try not to kite this one up too high. And it ballooned, but let's see if it balloons right to the perfect yardage. Ooh, coming down off the ridge a little bit. He'll Safety have maybe first, a, first. <laughs> 25, 30 footer. Wow. Beautiful shot out of there. All right, Bisky for birdie. Coach is in there tight for his part, but. Mm, beautiful putt here. Wow, just broke off at the end. Bisky 
You got one back. Oh, just barely clawing in, trying <laughs> to stay alive. It's been a little bit ugly today for me, not gonna lie, I've been grinding. Coach has made a few birdies. I've been trying to be patient, but I'm running out of holes, so hopefully something happens soon. We have par five coming up here. It's hole number 14 at Madaris. It's a long one, so kind of plays well to Beeski's strengths. Can that reach the bunker? I don't think so. Three shot hole, doesn't matter. Coach, long way home. Little punchy layup to the lower tier of the fairway. All right, B hit a huge drive right here. He's in the left side fairway bunker. He's probably got to hit like a seven or eight iron. Out of here, hit a good one. A little layup on the lower tier with Coach as well. Yeah, we'll do a little closest too. It's got 135 yards right in the layup zone. You can see how difficult that pin is. It's all the way back, but you got to carry it all the way over the ravine. Nice strike. A little bit right and long, but it's a great little, great little outcome from that. All right, B has 135. He's going to wedge. He's a couple yards in front of I was, and uh, this is going left of the pin, but it should be okay. Oh my gosh, <laughs> it's coming all the way back. Wow. <laughs> Every time I'm back here, I swear he aims for me. This is unreal. <laughs> he deserves that. He deserves that. Oh, you dodged a bullet. Dude, thank you very much. Claire dodged a bullet too. <laughs> All right, hole 15, par three, 250 yards, all into the wind, downhill, pins tucked in the back left corner. Really good hole here. Biski fanned it to the right. It's gotta catch that hill. It's turning over. Come on, go. I heard it hit the green. Long ways home from grandma's house. He's well over 100 feet. Big ridge to come over. Oh, this is definitely not where he wants to go. He missed the hump and he's not gonna be happy with that. Coach didn't hit it particularly tight with his birdie shot, so here is here is Beesky's second shot. Feeding down there, not bad. I'll tell you what it does. It goes that way and then that way? Really yeah, firm. just uh, right edge. Oh, sorry coach. <laughs> I hope you didn't do that because you were listening to me. Oh. oh my gosh! Unbelievable! Oh my gosh! Unbelievable! Oh man, that's that why you never talk up. until it hits the bottom of the cup. <laughs> I thought he was gonna make that one too, but yeah, Kevin Na's cool and all, but like, remember, we're amateurs out here. So, hole 16, 440 down the hill, little breeze off the left, and a ravine all down the left and between the fairway and the green. This hole was not an easy hole. 210 into the wind. Going left. Ball's above his feet. Caught that one nice and clean. It's going right at the pin. Ooh, be the number. Beautiful shot. Coach here with another long putt. Say about 60 feet. And it's a little low. All right, now we got a little beastie action here. Mm. Great. Nice 
No well, birdies today. That'll do it for me. Good match, bud. That was fun. Yeah, you hit some really good shots today. All right, I'm tired of seeing these dudes three jack all their putts. I'm gonna be playing all their short shots in all the chips and putts with their own clubs from here on out. Show them how it's done. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Okay, 165, par three out here at Madeiras. Match is over and uh, pins way back. Just need him to get it somewhere on the putting surface for me and I'll drain it. Nice high seven for Bisky, coming down just left of the pin. Ooh, a little long, wow. Long? Yeah, a little long. If you guys are ever in a tournament for whatever reason, a club championship, or if you enter one, just know you can't pat these down, that's a penalty. So. Only on the green can you fix ball marks before you hit the shot. Oh, this looks really good. That is about as good as you can do from there. Well done. Oh! <laughs> Woo! Like I said, easy shot. Thanks for the deuce. <laughs> All right, now to uh, try Big Red out. Hmm. I don't even know how to use a, a mallet putter. <laughs> that was really fun. Um, I mean, my thoughts over the ball. I wanted to land it somewhere in between like the fringe and the front edge of the green. I landed it a little bit long, but my goal with that one was just to like not let my hands pass through under to keep them moving with that face open. And uh, it worked out. One hopped and kind of just bounced in there. So that was really fun. Hole number 18, par five, 600 yards straight away, a little bit downhill. If you carry that bunker, you hit the speed slot, you might be able to get home in two. Wow, what a gorgeous shot. Oh my gosh, Bisky. That's not fair to the rest of us. All right, coach here, driver off the deck. Whoa. All right, Bisky hit a huge drive up here. He's probably got about 275. It's going three wood. Beautiful strike on that one. Nice high Come on, baby, be draw right. there. All right, I left Claire with a tough little 40, maybe 45 yard shot. And uh, she hit it just a low. That was beautiful. I mean, absolutely couldn't have done much better than that. She's got a little seven footer up the hill. B hit uh, this par five and two. Claire's got about 65 feet down the hill over a couple of ridges. This looks wonderful. Settle. Yeah, really well, well done, right well done. Oh, like wiggled. Mm. All right, okay. good par. These are my putters. <laughs> All right, guys, that was part two of the match between Coach and Bisky. Hope that you enjoyed the match. It was fun to be a part of. The guys hit some amazing shots, uh, made some clutch putts, so it was really fun to watch and film some of those shots. Hope that you guys enjoyed as well. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button, the subscribe button, and leave us a comment below on what your favorite part of the match was. Hopefully you guys enjoyed me kind of finishing it out, hitting a few shots, what I can do with my poor injured shoulder right now, but um, hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Oh my god, Bisky. What in the world are you doing? 165, par three, hole 17, at Madeira's Golf Club. Stop to <laughs> redo. <laughs> Carry that bunker, you hit the speed slot, you might be able to get home in two. Wind it today. <laughs> you just catch your breath. I catch my breath from the pictures. The real reason I do these greenside angles is because I get to find the shade on the course and then I just get to relax. 
Um, the boys are not playing too great today and it's super hot. Now I'm getting a nice breeze in the shade here, which I am absolutely loving. Um, but hopefully you guys are enjoying part two. Um, and yeah, let me know if you like me commentating when I can't play, but I'm um, just doing what I can. Shoulders acting up a bit, but I'll be back. I'll be back in the ring in a couple days.